Right now, let's talk about one of the most important ways that you can improve fuel economy. The way you shift and what gear you're in affect fuel economy big time. The higher the RPM, the more fuel you're using. That's so important, let's repeat it. The higher the RPM, the more fuel you're using. Revolutions per minute, or RPM, is so important that Cummins engines have special features to help you operate your vehicle at the best possible RPM for maximum fuel economy, all the while giving you the power you need when you need it. Those features include load based speed control and several more that we'll talk about later. When you start off and accelerate, you want to run the RPM just high enough so that when you shift, the engine comes back into gear at an RPM that enables you to keep picking up speed. But the bottom line is, you don't want to run up the RPM any higher than you absolutely have to. It used to be true that engines operated better at a higher RPM. You'd run up the RPM to get the pulling power you needed. But now, diesel engines, especially Cummins engines, operate with excellent pulling power at low RPM. Of course, while today's engines do operate at lower RPM to increase fuel economy, in certain driving conditions, downshifting may be necessary where additional power is needed. The latest Cummins ISX15 engine gives peak pulling power all the way back to 1000 RPM and the ISX12 at 1100 RPM. So you don't need to run up the RPM like you used to. In fact, Operating the engine above 1600 RPM in some applications actually hurts fuel economy. The quicker you get to top gear and stay there, the better. If you're spending only 75 or 80% of your time in top gear instead of 90%, you're losing three or four percentage points in fuel economy. That could be $1,800 or $2,400 a year in fuel costs. Experts estimate that the difference between efficient operators and less efficient operators is as much as 30% when it comes to fuel economy. When we're talking $60,000 a year in fuel costs, that's a lot of money. So Cummins urges you to work with the factors under your control. The trailer gap, the tire pressure, shifting techniques, idling time, to be as efficient as you possibly can. Time for a knowledge check. At what RPM does an ISX-15 have more torque? At 1000 to 1600 RPM or at 1900 to 2300 RPM? Operating the engine above 1600 RPM in heavy duty applications actually hurts fuel economy. So you get your power economically at lower RPM and save fuel. With all of the technological advancements made to Cummins engines and the ability to produce torque at lower RPM, the sweet spot or most efficient engine operating spot has moved down. Previously, when peak torque was at 1200 RPM, the sweet spot was between 1400 and 1550 RPM. With peak torque now available at 1000 RPM for an ISX 15 below 475 horsepower, the sweet spot is between 1150 and 1300 RPM.